Hey, it's Aiden again from youtube.com slash myapplehelp. Today, what we're going to be looking at is spaces. Now, Apple has pretty much fixed the problem of offices who have more than one computer on one desk, and they have a mouse that moves um, from one screen to the other, and you, just dr and you can keep dragging your files from each computer to computer. Well, why spend that much money if you can just get a Mac, and you can have four separate computers? Let's take a look. So, here, down here on, sp on spaces, you have four different um, computers, I guess you could say. Um, so say I wanted to open up Yahoo Messenger here. Right here. And then I had Safari opened up in another window. And then I wanted to look at some pictures, and I wanted to check my calendar, and I was going to talk to some people on Skype. Well, that's kind of crammed all for one desktop. So why not just click on Spaces, and I can drag my calendar into here, iPhoto into here, Yahoo Messenger, and um, Safari here, Take Skype, go in here. there you go. So now, if I want to go to another, I, I on my on my keyboard it's F1, and I have I can check my calendar here. Press F1. I can instant message here, and I can do whatever I need to do here. Then say I need I want to go and add something to my calendar because I just figured out that um, from an email that I have to go to a barbecue on Friday. So I'll go here to Friday. And I can add that event. It's pretty much as simple as that. Um, every Mac comes installed with Spaces. Really easy software to use. In your system preferences, you can choose what button will make the Spaces appear, which means you can choose when you can have different screens. On mine, I choose to use the key F1. But other than that, it's a very useful and easy program to use on the Mac. So. Um, I'll um, talk to you later. Thanks for watching.